Hi, my name is Vesna. Today I thought I would make something different than the usual. I got a lot of feedback from my last video that you liked my talking video and I mean I enjoyed making it but as you can see by the title I'm not only gonna be talking today, I'm gonna be dyeing my hair with Larish Directions. I don't know how if I said that right but this is the color silver. Disclaimer, I'm not by any means an expert on this shit. I'm not a professional. I mean, I love changing my hair, I love dyeing my hair, but this is not a tutorial at all. <laughs> I just recently dyed it to this, I mean, I had it before, this this white, white blondish, but like I forgot <laughs> to bleach my hairline, so it turned out a little bit yellow, whatever. I mean, I don't care. Cause like I change my hair all the time and I mean these directions they don't hold for a long time they are just like not really color they're just I don't know how it's called in English whatever so I'm gonna dye my hair with this tonight and meanwhile I'm gonna answer some questions from the TMI tag too much information tag from YouTube also I know that this has been done before in this format I'm not trying to um, copy anyone it's just I don't know, I just felt like doing it. I watched a couple tutorials on, I mean specifically Larish. None of these people whom I watched to use this color silver got silver. And I'm also not really aiming for silver. Many people got some like kind of lavender-ish tone. So that's what I'm aiming for right now. But we'll see what we're gonna get. Maybe it's gonna be a total fail, we'll see. But what I've already done is the instructions say that you have to um, wet your hair first and shampoo it just with a little mild shampoo. So that's what I'm already what I already did, and they are wet still, so or moist. <laughs> I've got my applying brushes or however do you call them. These are uh, I got some gloves and uh, my I don't know my comb. Oh yeah, and I have a towel, I have a shirt, I have an old shirt on and I have a bowl to mix the color in or basically just to put it in because like this is very small and I can't really put my brush in. So I'm gonna part my hair first. Also in this video I'm gonna look a lot on the screen and not on the camera. I'm sorry in advance but like I don't have a mirror here. <laughs> Shit, okay, now you can see like how I fa failed in dyeing my hair. Whatever. Also fun fact, when I dyed them first uh, they turned out pink-ish. I honestly don't know why, but I mean that's another story. Whatever. It looked cool, so we'll see. Maybe it will turn out pinkish now too. I'll put on my gloves. So I'm gonna look down here because here is my phone, so I can see the questions. Here is my other uh, color. I'm opening it now and putting it in. Already stained towel before I start doing this. Oh well. Now it looks like I'm in a blanket. But these, like these colors, these directions, they really stain. Like I've already uh, used them once before and they like leave stains. This is how the color looks. It's like kind of a bluish, purplish color. And it's like this goo. So now I'm just gonna put it in the, oh, fail. <laughs> so this is how the color looks when you like put it out of the box. It's like a little gooey in the beginning. It's, like, it's more like a slime. <laughs> okay, so I think I'm ready to apply. First question is, what are you wearing right now? I'm wearing uh, these workout pants and I'm wearing this black shirt and a towel because I'm dyeing my hair. Have you ever been in love? Yes. And this is the part where we're starting. Fuck. You know what I forgot? I forgot to apply Vaseline. That's very important. Shit, wait. <laughs> okay, so what you didn't see now is I applied um, Vaseline all over my here, my forehead and my neckline and my ears because, like I said, the color stains a lot. So now I'm gonna put these back on and we're gonna continue applying the color properly this time. I'm gonna start with the with the roots because I'm kind of hoping it will get out the this yellowish effect a little. This is a mess. I should have done this with a mirror, but whatever. Also, I'm going to my parents and my mother 
usually freaks out a little when I dye my hair. Last time I freaked her out was when I dyed it like totally silver. Yeah, I dyed it really silver and was very surprised because she didn't know that I was gonna do that when I... Like, I got my hair done and then I, in the evening, went to see them and we went for dinner and I had new, like, newly dyed silver hair. Oh wow, I look like some, some guy from from an anime or something. Things you do for beauty. So now I'm gonna go to the back. I don't know. This is just my method. I have no idea if this will turn out okay or whatever. Maybe for the next question. What's your zodiac sign? I'm an Aries or how is it called? Aries? My birthday is in April so maybe you know what I mean. And I think it really applies to me because I mean I don't really believe in horoscopes and all that but like some of the stuff that is led about Aries totally applies to me, so... Do you have any tattoos? Nope. But I'm planning on it. I, I like really, really fucking want a tattoo. I look like a crazy professor <laughs> right now. So now I'm gonna apply the rest to my head because I think that's like easier. Have you ever been in a physical fight? Yes, I have. I used to get into physical fights all the time when I was in elementary school. I'm just gonna do it like this now, with my hands. I look like a smurf. <laughs> wow. I think I left out a huge part now. Yep. Cool. What's your favorite color? Blue. Cool. <laughs> Camera memory is cool, whatever. Uh, but what you didn't see is I just finished applying the color. It's now completely in. I've set a timer, instructions say about 15 minutes, I think I'm gonna let it sit it on a little longer just because like I said I saw a lot of videos where it didn't work at all and I just want some results so yeah. So I think meanwhile I'm just gonna ask some more TMI questions while we wait. Um, favorite actress? Um, Kate Winslet, definitely. <laughs> I mean I love her in movies and also like she's hot. Do you have any fears? Yes. I have a very, very severe fear of waspies, anything that looks like that, like that is striped yellow and black, or like even hornets, fuck. I'm so scared of them. So like when when some of those <laughs> fly around, I'm running out. I just had an occasion where my friend Lisa, I think I mentioned her in a video, um, shout out to you Lisa by the way, <laughs> if you're watching this. I had a window open and a bee flew in and I ran out of my dorm and smacked the door, closed it and then I was like standing at the door listening to the bee buzzing in my room and then I, I wrote Lisa because she lives, she used to live above me and she saved me, she pushed the bee out of the window, she didn't kill it, she just pushed it out and I could live on in my room so yeah that's a huge fear of mine. Bees and wasps and all of that kind of crap. So, Meaning behind your YouTube name. So, I mean, on my Instagram, on my uh, Twitter and on my YouTube channel I have this Alice in the name. First reason is Alice in Wonderland, of course. I love Alice in Wonderland. I also love Alice Madness Returns, the game, the video game. If you haven't heard of that, like it's so it's so good and so beautiful, it's so beautifully made and like it's a horror game, I love horror games. So, but I kind of relate to Alice a little bit, like just making up your whole world in your own mind. That's why I have Alice everywhere and I just want, I didn't want to use Vesna because it's Alice is more catchy and I think if I would have chosen my name at birth it would have been Alice, so Alice. Last book you read. Ooh, it's called Relic. I forgot the name of the authors but I'm gonna write them like Editor Visna, write them right here or um relic. It's a thriller. It was very good. It was very thrilling. <laughs> and now I'm reading uh, Sebastian Fitzek's um, The Package, which is also pretty intense so far. I mean, yeah, not something for people who don't. I don't know who get nervous. I mean, it's it's already already intense for me. So mm. last show you watched, Friends. I have it paused on my TV because I'm gonna watch it after I'm done filming this video and washing out my hair dye. But yeah, Friends, I always watch, like I have a habit, I watch Friends before falling asleep. I love Friends, I've rewatched it a hundred million times, it's so good. Last song you sang, 
I was jamming to Love So Soft by Kelly Clarkson while make washing the dishes a couple hours ago. <laughs> so that's the one that I sang last. I don't even know which is the last song I posted on my YouTube channel. I think it's Oh Big Girls Don't Cry by Fergie maybe. The relationship between you and the person you last texted. Let's see. The person I last texted was my sister. <laughs> Hi Lynch. Favorite food? Oh, that's tough. Pancakes. I love pancakes. We're on 10 minutes now. I don't know if you can see it. Yes. So not even close to what should be done. A place you want to visit? Um, oh, there's lots of places I want to visit, but I would love to go... By the way, sorry that I'm scratching, like, my nose is very itchy. One place I would love to visit is Iceland. I would love to go to, like, some smaller city in England. Um, I would love to go to Costa Rica, the Easter Islands, yeah. Last time you were insulted, hmm. I mean, that's a good thing that I don't remember the last time I was insulted. I actually don't remember. Well, cool. Let's keep it up that way. Let's keep the positive vibes up. <laughs> Favorite flavor of sweet? Chocolate, definitely. Um, what instruments do you play? The guitar. That's the only instrument I play. Who should answer these questions next? Ooh. Well, I tag, I mean, if that's still a thing, I tag Sophia and Beto. <laughs> they have a YouTube channel called Vlogworthy. I'll link it in the description box. They're a really fun couple. They make like these travel vlogs and like little videos. <coughs> See, it's true. I don't know, do you say that in English too? We say, it's true when you sneeze while you're saying something. So yeah, I'll link them in the description box below. Check them out. They're cool. They're awesome. And now we're on almost 15 minutes. So I'm gonna watch some more friends and then wash this out. And I'm gonna show you how it looks in a second. <laughs> so <laughs> I washed my hair now. It's almost dry. And I don't know if you can t see, but there's parts of it that are like a little pinkish, lavenderish, just like a little bit, a tad. So like, I wouldn't say it's a complete fail, but it's also not really a win. <laughs> like I expected a little more, but I've already seen this in other tutorials, so I guess I shouldn't have expected more than this. But not uh, any shade to Larish directions whatsoever. Like I, I mean, it's, it's cute. There are some pinkish, like this is basically what I had when I dyed my hair a couple, what, two weeks ago or something. It's basically the same effect, but that's, that's okay. It won't, it won't freak out my mother. <laughs> so I hope you enjoyed this video. I'm gonna go to bed now because I'm so tired. And uh, yeah, thanks for watching as always. Give me suggestions what you wanna see next. I think I'm gonna cover a song next again or we'll see we'll see what i come up with <laughs> i hope you enjoyed and leave a like if you did bye